And now, your Precision 18 forecast. News 18. Weather from where you live. Well, folks, I'm going to be the bearer of bad news here. I hate to do this to you, but you may want to grab that scraper as you head out the door this morning. I actually woke up, head of the work this morning right around 3 o'clock, and found frost on my windshield stepping out the door. Winds are relatively calm right now from the southwest right around 3 miles per hour. Sadly, the southwesterly winds will not help warm things up a whole lot throughout the day. Today, it's 36 degrees right now, mainly clear skies. We are seeing a few light clouds begin to filter in from the west as well. A weak frontal system is passing to the north of us. We see a few isolated showers over the next few hours, but for the most part, we will be staying dry and cool this morning. Now, during the afternoon, an abundance of sunshine will actually help warm things up a little bit warmer than what we, they were yesterday. However, at the same time, temperatures are still expected to be about 12 degrees below the average high later today. You can see that system finally pass off to the east. Some light clouds may linger into the lunch hour, maybe even later than that, but for the most part, we're looking at a mostly sunny afternoon. Temperatures today expected to warm up into the mid to low 50s. We'll be at 54 degrees here in Lafayette with a light chance of clouds this morning. Maybe, just maybe, an isolated shower with winds from the west right around 10 to 20 miles per hour. We could see wind gusts as high as 25 miles per hour. And that could bite overnight tonight because what we're looking at as far as overnight low temperatures, down near freezing again. 32, your overnight low for Lafayette will drop to 32 in Crawfordsville as well. Fowler looking right around 33 overnight tonight into tomorrow morning. We could be dealing with some patchy frost tonight into tomorrow, but the good news is by tomorrow, that high pressure moving off the Great Plains, clearing out the cloud cover this morning, that will all move eastward tomorrow, bringing southerly winds to the region and boosting temperatures up across the viewing area. However, at the same time, it could also bring a chance for some more cloud cover as well. Notice the upper level moisture Futurecast has moving in. Now it also has a few isolated showers. We're going to be staying dry for Friday. We could be seeing a few chances for rain come Saturday as a low pressure system makes its way up the Ohio River Valley up towards the northeastern United States. That could bring a chance for some isolated rainfall for Saturday afternoon and evening. But for the most part, Friday saying, whoa, 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 it's turning around. All right. Let's bring it back. Here we go. All right, back to weather, folks. So what we're seeing is temperatures warming up to around 64 tomorrow afternoon. Mostly sunny skies during the morning. By the afternoon, things could be a little bit more cloudy. Winds are from the southwest right around 10 to 15 miles per hour. Now, temperatures will be warming all the way up to around the mid-60s, both Friday and Saturday by Sunday, all the way up to the 70s. We could see 78 on Monday, Tuesday, believe it or not, folks. We're looking at a high temperature right around 80 degrees. I know this forecast is so exciting that we wanted to get right to the end so I could talk about the 80s, but winds will be a little bit cooler come Wednesday with high temperatures right around 69. Got a nice weekend. Definitely. Okay, thanks, Cameron.